Good day, brothers and sisters. This is Steve Sandoval, and welcome to Pathways of Hope. Today, we celebrate the Feast of the Immaculate Conception of Mary. And in the Gospel reading, Mary shows herself as the perfect vessel to bear the Son of God as she says the words, Here am I, the servant of the Lord. Let it be done to me according to your word. Those words of faith spoken by Mary struck me in my reflection of this reading because it is the kind of attitude we should have as followers of Jesus. In one of the occasions where Jesus was ministering, a woman shouted out to Jesus, Blessed is the womb that bore you and blessed are the breast that nursed you. And Jesus in reply said, Blessed rather are those who hear the word of God and obey it. And who but Mary could be an example of the one who hears the word of God and obeys it. As soon as Mary was given this announcement, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And now you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and your na the name will be Jesus. She proceeded to ensure that the plan of our Lord would take place. Mary, with haste, went to Elizabeth to assist her, knowing that she was advanced in age and needed help in preparation for the birth of John the Baptist, who will prepare the way for Jesus to come into the world. Like Mary, I ask our Lord for the grace to consistently seek to follow the will of the Lord. In the passage, Mary did not bother to dwell on the difficult path ahead of her. I think she was probably anxious a little bit, but knowing the details that she was betrothed to Joseph and knowing that she will conceive by the power of the Holy Spirit, how would she explain this to Joseph and her family? But despite this difficult task ahead, she did not think about her situation. But at that present moment, she thought of the revelation of the angel that her cousin Elizabeth needed her help as she was advanced in age to conceive a child. So in haste, she went to Elizabeth. Let us pray together. Dear Lord, we pray. Grant us the grace to say daily, here am I, the servant of the Lord. Let it be according to your word. Help us to seek to be instruments of your love for others. We know there will be times that doing the right and loving act will be difficult and inconvenient. But like Mary who proceeded with haste to help Elizabeth, let us to proceed with consistency in doing the will of God, even in the ordinary day-to-day -day acts of serving those around us. May our God bless our desire to do His will. Amen.